Hey guys, Aaron here. I'm coming at you today with a watch strap review. Um, this is pretty cool. This is something that uh, I've been interested in for a long time, and getting this uh, Stoa Flieger was the perfect opportunity for this. Um, this strap is a closed loop aviator strap by Greg Stevens, GSD Leatherworks, or GSD Designs, I guess. Um, Greg is a custom watch strap maker working out of Utah. He's been making straps since 2005, and driven by a passion for both watches and leather, Greg started a business making bespoke watch straps in a market that had very few custom makers. Greg says on his website that um, a major motivation for him to start making straps was that he had larger wrists and couldn't find leather straps to fit him correctly. Not, uh, not too different from myself. So he just decided to make them. Um, this is a closed loop strap, like I said before, so you can see the tail does not come out of the buckle. Um, my Stoa, this watch, which I will review later, came with one. Here's the, the factory strap on it. Um, however, it was a little too small for my wrists, so I had him make me nearly the same identical strap, just a little longer. Um, the closed loop was one of the original style straps worn by early aviators. Um, and the closed loop design was conceptualized so that it could be adjusted over the wrist or over a flight suit without dropping it. You can imagine a standard open loop strap would be easily dropped if you were adjusting it on the fly. Um, these watches were used in conjunction with other instruments for navigation primarily. Um, the watches were issued by a quartermaster before combat pilots left on a sortie. They'd synchronize them all on the ground before taking off. And an added benefit of the closed loop strap is that they stack relatively flat and could be stored by the quartermaster after the mission. Um, but before we go any further, I want to direct your attention to a Scout Leather Company Torx and Driver Kit. Um, this thing is awesome. Um, I wasn't really a believer in these until a friend of mine got one of his own. And... Um, it's great, uh, and I can really see how useful it is. Um, I kind of view these like I do my Wicked Edge. It's an expensive piece of knife gear. However, most of us buy very expensive knives. So, in most cases, I think it's worthwhile to invest in quality tools to maintain those expensive knives. These are newly available from Urban EDC Supply, this channel's sponsor, and I highly suggest you shoot over there and check out what these guys are offering. The link is in the description. Okay, back to the watch strap. Um, so this strap is custom. Um, it's bespoke, so it is made for me, to my specifications to fit me. So in terms of comfort and use, obviously it is um, pretty perfect. It's exactly what I wanted because it was made exactly to my specifications. Um, it fits me as I wanted, it wears as I requested, it was made exactly how I want, like I said. So, this is going to be more of a review of Greg's handiwork. Um, he'll do the same thing for you, um, and anyone else that needs a watch strap. But, let's talk about quality here. It's really great. Um, the edges are all nicely finished. Um, the closed loop strap has rivets here, here and here, um, and that is to prevent the roller buckle here from traveling too far. Now he also stitched it to do that even more, but um, it's to prevent the roller buckle from rolling out of the strap like that. Um, the stitching, as you can see, is very straight and uniform, done by hand. Um, the hardware of this particular strap came off of a vintage French ammo bag, which is really neat. The leather itself is Horween's Coffee Dublin, world-class leather with old-world character, as Greg describes it. It's soft and supple, very comfortable to wear. It's currently summer in Tennessee, and uh, it's, we're getting into 90-degree 90 90 days with just bucket loads of humidity. And this strap has been super comfortable. Um, easily adjusted when it's hot out and starting to get kind of tight on the wrist and then snugged back up when you get into air conditioning. Um, I really couldn't be happier with how it fits me. Uh, let me look at my notes here. So, all in all, I just think it is a fantastic strap. Greg makes all kinds. He makes leather NATOs. He makes 
um, two-piece straps like this. He makes all kinds of straps, canvas, lined, unlined, and they're really, really great. Greg hand-delivered this to me at Blade Show this year. It was very cool to meet him in person. And there's something really special about ordering handmade goods and having the person that made it hand it to you. If I were you, I wouldn't hesitate to reach out to Greg and get your order in. Um, if you go to his website, which will be linked in the description, you're going to see all kinds of the different varieties that he has to offer. And um, it's just a matter of shooting him an email and getting your order in, and he will build you a really, really nice strap. So, pretty short review, but there's not a lot to be said about a really awesome piece of leather work. So, um, I highly recommend you guys shoot out there and get yourself a Greg Stevens. Thanks a lot. See ya.